And now we have new video tonight into the Wavy Newsroom. It shows a moment a car plunge into Little Neck Creek in Virginia Beach early this morning. And you can see that large splash and guard gate going with it. Well, we understand multiple people were in the car at the time. One person had to be extracted. Ten on your side's Brett Hall went back to the scene to see if he could find out more about what happened. The evidence of what happened out here last night still very clearly seen. About 20 feet of fencing missing from where Pinewood Road meets 32nd Street in Virginia Beach. And one man we spoke with, he saw it all happen. It was a minute after midnight Monday when 19 year old Andrew Long, walking out of 7 Eleven on 32nd Street at the oceanfront, heard the roaring sounds of two cars. And I saw two cars fly, fly by me going probably in excess of 80 miles an hour. He says as they were speeding towards Laskin Road. I was thinking in my head, like, I think those people are going to crash. Like, there's no way they get around that corner going that fast. And in what seems like the next second. It looked like they hit a little bump, and then I saw brake lights, like, up in the air. One car plunged into Little Neck Creek. The other came to a stop on the sidewalk. And Long wasted no time driving to the scene himself to see what he could do. Water and he's underground. Yeah. Don't there's one kid in the water. Uh, who had, was in the car and said that he had escaped through a window. He was in the water yelling, like, is this real life? Am I dreaming? And he had, like, a big cut on his right hand. He was bleeding. Long tried to hoist him out of the water. Another person was still trapped inside. Because it was flipped up like this. So it was like the back wheels were here, the front wheels were here. Long says first responders were right behind him and quickly went to work. Probably about 10, 15 minutes after. Um, they got there, they pulled him out of the water. Long doesn't know why they were driving so fast, but he says there is no doubt in his mind it is what caused the crash. I've never seen anything happen like that. While we don't have an update on the condition of those involved tonight, or if they have been sighted, Long says he'll never be able to drive down this road again without thinking about it. In Virginia Beach, Brett Hall, 10 on your side.